Welcome back guys to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan and let's talk about Atomic Heart. Atomic Heart is an upcoming FPS action role playing game and it is the being developed by Munfish and published by Focus Entertainment and 4 Divinity. The game is planned for release for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, Xbox One and Xbox Series X on February 21st of 2023. We are just a few weeks away. I am getting so excited for this game. I know a lot of you are. We've been waiting for this game for years now, right? If you've been following this game, it's been in development for over like five or six years now. It's been a long time and I'm finally excited to get my hands on it like I know most of you are. The game reminds me a lot of Bioshock. It has that type of feel where it has kind of that mystery to it. It kind of has that, um, you don't know what the heck's going on. <laughs> so we're going to have to wait to see when the game releases. Now, I'm actually showing on the screen some gameplay footage and it's pre-alpha. So I'm excited to get my hands on the game, like I said. I guess the game is set in a... Um, soviet russia right it's like its own universe and its own timeline i don't know if it's the 1920s 1930s i don't remember what they said exactly but uh it's like a sci sci-fi sci you know sci-fi type bioshock slash russian video game so it's definitely going to be interesting now you can see here that the game is going to be first person so there's definitely going to be a lot of action in it, but there's also going to be a lot of exploring because you're going to want to see, well, you know, what's in here, what's there. You can even see here that you can actually loot and pick up items. I believe there's actually going to be crafting. You can put new attachments on your guns. Now, there's actually going to be enemies in this game right here. And the enemies in this game are like controlled AI robots and... I don't know. The game just looks weird. There's just going to be like all these different creatures, all these different like robots running around. Uh, but the robots actually seem like they're just bullet soakers, right? Like they seem very um, indestructible a little bit. So that's going to be interesting to see. I guess this dude just fell out of a hole. So, but <laughs> it looks, oh, okay. He fell down, not up. I was like about to say, man, did he like fall up? down but he actually went up <laughs> i don't know i wouldn't be surprised because this game looks crazy anyways i know that i am super excited for this game man it's gonna be way cool the thing that i'm most nervous about is the game has been in development for so long to a point that i'm praying that the game turns out really good you know from what we've seen in gameplay the game looks looks amazing right it just looks incredible the engine they're building this on the graphics look crazy good. The There must be like a outbreak that took place and these robots and all these machines took over. So I'm interested to see what the story is going to be. Now, since the game is being developed by kind of a developer that nobody really knows about, I'm excited to see them get into the scene because if this is their first game that they've done and it's going to be a big game that they've done man i'm excited to see what else these guys can push out like can you imagine the next games are going to be developing we haven't even got atomic heart yet and i'm already excited to see what they're going to be bringing out so you can see kind of some of the gameplay here it's a little bit crazy right like these dudes do like karate chops and flips and these robots will like drop kick you and <laughs> it's just like all over the place so i don't know it's going to be cool Okay, this dude just picked up some food, I'm assuming. Ooh, that looks crazy. One of the things I do like, um, also, this game reminds me a lot of Prey, right? Prey and Bioshock. And if you guys have, pray, have, have prayed, have you guys have played the new Prey, um, the, the reboot version that came out a couple of years ago, it was very similar to this, right? It was very open world. The combat was very similar as in like the melee and the guns. The enemies, like these dudes just charge at you and go crazy. Look at this dude, he's like trying to kick him. And look at, they seem like indestructible, right? Like you just keep hitting them and hitting them and they don't go down. <laughs> like doing karate chops on the dude. You can see here when they get hit though, they get hit and there's no blood. I wonder if they're getting like oil spilled out of them because I'm assuming, yeah, they are robots, right? So that's going to be interesting. And the, the aesthetic of this game just looks amazing. The art, the art design, the graphics. 
I mean, goodness gracious, the game just looks beautiful. Is he going to get in this machine? I guess we'll see. Oh, okay, he just picked up a shotgun. So he, now he's got a shotgun, but he's using his melee weapon for a long time now. Man, just every little detail of this game looks incredible. I can't wait to play it. It's going to be cool. I'm hoping you guys are just excited to play this game as I am. Look at that. Just, man, the detail and everything, the art direction, everything they're going towards. This looks like, a, like an amusement park or the way you just get around the facility, I guess. Now, I'm curious to see if you're going to have so much freedom to a point where you can go and explore anything you want. Because it looks like you do, right? Obviously, there's going to be some sort of linear path because the game, you know, obviously it's going to have a story and... You know, you got to follow the story and all that, but this is going to be interesting. My question is, why doesn't he just go on the side and walk over there? Maybe you can't, I guess. It's like blocked off. Yeah, I'm excited for this game. I can't wait for it. It's going to be cool. I want to know your guys' thoughts down in the comments below. If you guys are excited for Atomic Heart, definitely let us know. I'm definitely going to be picking it up when it comes out. I'm probably going to do a live playthrough of it. So that would be cool. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like the video, subscribe to the channel, and I will see you on the next one. Take care.